Here's a scene that gives new meaning to the phrase, in the privacy of your own home. How'd you like to wake up to this behind you? Talk about living in a fishbowl. As lot sizes are getting smaller, but the homes are getting bigger, privacy is one of the biggest problems for homeowners. One of the best ways to combat this problem is with proper use of landscaping. When you have sufficient amount of space, redwood trees, sequoia sempervirin, are a great alternative for privacy. They're an evergreen tree, they're fast growing, they grow about three to five feet a year. You can only grow them in a more temperate climate, they won't do well in the snow, but they can grow up to 300 feet. They're an evergreen, they're low maintenance, and they're a perfect solution to get rid of that nosy neighbor. On the other hand, when you have limited space, but you need maximum amount of screening, I would recommend using the Italian cypress. They're an evergreen tree that grows to about 35 feet tall, but they only need about three or four feet of space for circumference. And as you can see, they make a really wonderful screen to get rid of unsightly views. Two great outdoor screening plants. This one behind the outdoor kitchen is a bay laurel, Laurus nobilis. It'll grow about 35 feet tall, and the beauty of it is it's an evergreen, and you can dry the leaves and use it in your spaghetti sauce. In a shaded environment that we have behind us, we've used the Podocarpus gracilia, or the Japanese fern pine. That'll get about 18 to 20 feet tall. It's an evergreen. Now you notice I keep stressing the word evergreen. That's because we want plants that keep their leaves all year round, so you get maximum amount of screening. Whatever plants you choose for privacy in your yard, a screen of green enhances the beauty of both sides of the fence. I mean, isn't this a nicer visual than this?